Hello! And welcome. Say something. Something. <laughs> well, what's going on guys? Today we are gonna be updating you on our workout routine. Before we were doing some mobility work, we were doing some stability work just to kind of really get our foundation built, right? Yeah. Strengthening up our core. Core's gotta be strong. Yeah, strong core, yeah. Gotta make gains, mm. yeah. <laughs> so now we're moving on to a more of a power phase and we decided to do a conjugate system, style of training. It's not the exact style that you would expect from like a west side barbell where they have all the access to a bunch of weird bars and a bunch of weird bands and stuff. So we kind of have to tailor it to our needs because we pretty much just have a bar and some boxes, which is good because we're going to do some box squats. We started off, we did some mobility work, did our normal routine starting off, and then we moved to try to get a heavy single. This was our power day. And this was not fun for me. <laughs> yeah, you ever have one of those days where you just like don't want to be in the gym? This... Me neither. Yeah, yeah, me neither. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. <laughs> well, this was this was one of those days. It was it was late at night. We were both kind of like just dragging after a kind of long day. Dragging. <laughs> so we worked up to a heavy single on our power day. Well, we used a um, below parallel box, which you loved, right? You loved going. You know, uh, there's this thing that the government says that you can't do cruel and unusual punishment to prisoners. Yeah. And you were doing that. To you? Yeah. I also did to myself. Ooh, okay, I don't know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> I did not like this box. It was way too low. I told him that it was way too low. He didn't care. We kept doing it. Yeah, and you did great. I believe you worked up to 115, um, which is, you tried 135. Didn't work. Didn't work, but You see I, how much this didn't work? Do you it, see that? It was her first time squatting off of a box, and I did this maybe like twice before this session. It was pretty awkward for us to do, because we were both really bad right out of the hole. Like, we get to our depth, and then we hit this point of just like, can't move. Help! This is where the box squat's gonna help, because it's making us stop completely, and then explode out of the hole. So, that's why I chose the below parallel box. It was, it was rough, it was fun. You loved it, I'm trying to make you stronger. I don't wanna be stronger, I just wanna be hot. You are hot. Yeah. No. Oh, aren't we good looking? Why aren't we good looking yet? Thumbnail. We worked up the heavy single. You did 115, I believe. You tried 135, couldn't get it. I worked up to two, uh, 225, and that felt like death, so I stopped. That's the beautiful thing about the conjugate system. You work up to a heavy single, whatever you can work up to that day. Whatever feels good, though. It just kind of depends on that day, right? Yeah. I know you can do more than 135. I've seen you do more than 135. I've done 185, 185. Yeah, Yes, you have. And it's just it's just the box squat's awkward, it's different, and we're just trying to challenge our own bodies here. Challenge. So just to get more adapted to the box squat, we moved on to five sets of three. Which really kind of hit me, and then they got to roll like six D20 each for my damage. Uh -huh. Because I was just really tired after failing out of my heavy single. Yeah, that, that takes it out of you if you try to. Yeah, she was she was grinding for a second and then it just kind of she was kind of spent after that. But you still pushed through it. We took 70% of our max, worked with that weight, and we did the five sets of three. And then like like we said, we were kind of kind of not really feeling this workout too much. It's because of your stupid box. Blame the box. Blame the box. It's not me, it's the box. So for our accessory work, we did the five sets of three, just to kind of get more in tuned with the box. Mm. And then we moved on, we did some um, stiff-legged deadlifts with dumbbells, which are really good for the glutes and hams because- Glutes and hams, glutes, glutes and hams. Getting the booty working. Yeah. Getting our hamstrings work. We both have, I mean, I wouldn't say we both have, I would say I have weak glutes. Yeah. Your glutes are a bit stronger than mine. Yeah. I know. Yeah, strong glutes. Hi. Hello. My glutes are so strong. We did, what, how many sets of that? We did like four or five sets of, yeah. of like eight to ten. Or nothing super heavy, just trying to really feel the extension, feel the muscle break down, feel the stretch. I feel the pump. I had a pump. Yeah, my butt. It, ew. <laughs> Sounds like a personal problem. You're a personal problem. <laughs> uh, we kind of, after that, said, hey, we're, we're done. We're going to save it for the next workout. And we went home and Got some food. I don't think we got any food. We got some food. What'd we get? McDonald's. Yeah, we got McDonald's. We got the McDoubles. We're the healthiest people on hey, Instagram. Balkan on Instagram. This is YouTube. We're on Instagram too. Check us out at Kill the Games. That about wraps it up, folks. So if you like the video, go ahead and hit that like button for us. Leave a comment if there's something you want to see us do. Yeah, please. Last but not least, join the guild today and hit that subscribe button. And we look forward to seeing you in the next video.
What do you think? Join the guild! Join it! Yeah!